Link 2012. This is too much, too much. There's too many baddies. <laughs> oh boy, man. We need space. We need so much space. Okay, so do we need grapples or should we keep likes on us? I don't know, it's a hard choice because I know that the likes give us regen, the apples give us regen. We probably won't go very far from here. I mean, we're... You got that region, but we don't want to do go to that region right now because <laughs> stuff's good, just gonna keep on spawning. Keep on giving us trouble. Like I feel safe opening this chest right now. That's how bad that region is. Oh, firecrackers! <gasps> I forgot about firecrackers. I love the firecrackers. <laughs> Let me grab these and show you guys how to do it. So, I see he got attacked at, thanks to the hacker sword. But it doesn't seem to be a big deal right now. Um, but yeah, firecrackers. Let's go ahead and do a firecracker. It's like a firecracker in real life! <laughs> That's pretty fun. Okay, so what now? What should I do? This area. Oh, did we ever get the, uh... <gasps> I'm gonna take the like, the diamond, but... Fireworks from there, that's pretty cool. What's going on up there? We're good, we're good. Oh, we should probably grab one of these heads. Where to now? I guess we can continue going around this uh, edge of things. We didn't get in there. I didn't get whatever was in here. Oh, I did get the head in the end. I was confused as to why I wasn't getting the head. Alright. Oh, holy moly, there's something down there. For sure. We're gonna check that out after we clear up this place a bit more, though. Oh, this is Rezus's library, isn't it? Welcome to the VIP area. But unfortunately, that sign's fading. Come on, I just want to kill a spawner. Oh, they're spawning on that end. Get over here. This looks like it's going pretty well. Who knows here, it doesn't look like there's anything over here, ironically. Although we can mine out and escape. Well, crit can one hit kill them, which is kind of neat. So we might need to go down a little bit. There's a lot of crazy spawning. And that's affecting us negatively. Alright, what are these boots? Rune boots, okay. I don't know how many rune items I put here in this area. I think I put three full sets. I, I always try to put... I, I always think of three because multiple players, the biggest team you have is three usually. Yeah, take 
that. If they want it, the rebels can get by the on fire. I'm guessing they're all coming from down there, though. It doesn't look like there's any spawners in here. I'm just trying to see if there's any more heads I want. Let's go down. Alright, now we'll know for sure if there's one in here or not. I did not know about this secret until I I was working on this one. And I found it. I mean, you had to go into Brezis' library and then you had to come down here. I think I might have seen it because there were glitches. Um, where you could get into a wall and then see things throughout the, throughout the map. That was probably the only way. So I want to read this stuff. So this says, From the depths we rise, we are coming. Oh cool, and there's some stuff up here. One of these for sure. You know, the question is. Actually, I'm curious about as to what's up here. I have just another one of these droppers. I mean, just item poppers. <laughs> okay. Good. Very good. There's some gravel here, but I doubt that's anything. You know how gravel you usually means something in CTMs. In these areas, it's sort of hard to hide stuff like that. Okay. Oh boy, looks like we have some items here. Uh, Breastplate of Righteousness, Thorns 24. Wow. That's pretty cool. I like that. And just all sorts of instant health and stuff like that. And some legendary items. I want to take those legendary items. So I think we're going to have to go drop off some stuff. Oh, we can drop off the fireworks right here. Beautiful. We can't really do more than one little section before we have to move on. Oh boy. I just want to get some water. Where to next? Not there. That's not there. Right. I want to jump up and then do that. So someone dies of the fall damage. Holy moly, what on earth? These guys are are absurd. Alright, well, we can kill these guys several different ways. I think that's gonna be the most fun, enjoyable way. Oh, nope. Yep, I know. Yeah, they're all getting Ah, take that! <laughs> I'll take this. Oh, that's just funny. There's just so many of them. Yeah. And now I bet I need my hacker sword. Oh, no, we're out of here. We are out of here. Get lit on fire. That's about it for now. Oh, one hit kills now. That's nice. Oh. Yeah, you know it's also convenient. Running away from your issues. Okay, we are going to drop stuff off once again. I don't know though. I'm getting a little bit tired actually. I might need to uh, take a break soon. That arrow points towards yourself, then it points up. What's that about? I wonder. Not really, I know, but... You guys don't. Alright, I do want one of these guys hit. It's one terrible hit in order to be in our mo head monument area. Oh, we already do have a strafe head. The real strafe head. This is not the real Strafe's head, I don't think. This is 
from the cut of it. I probably should put one like in here too. So we get the dislike and we get the like. The like is actually all the way around. The dislike is only on one face. Which is interesting. Mm-hmm. Let's go drop everything off. They're just so fast. Oh boy, yeah, we are too fast at this point in time. It's actually scaring me. You know what? I think we're going to put the likes away for now. We're going to retire them. Put them in our special items container. Uh, because golden apples serve the same purpose. And to be honest with you, uh, golden apples, we, we don't need both. It takes up too much space. We really don't need both a spawner buster and a diamond pickaxe too. Really don't need two bows either. You know, I'm just try sitting here trying to think about how to free up inventory space. This is already power seven. Do I prefer the lucid dream though? I really do like the lucid dream. But it doesn't really work for the cherubims. How do you get the cherubims down? Okay, you know what? We're actually going to put the harpoon gun in here for now. Just for now, though. Um, we're going to keep Lucid Dream. We're going to put. We're going to try to upgrade Lucid Dream actually a little bit here. Please tell me I have infinity. Okay. We actually have. We're getting enough arrows. We don't need infinity really. Do we have punch? punch. Unbreaking. These are the things we need for lucid dream. To be overpowered. Alright, now lucid dream is just a completely maxed bow. Only need one arrow. We will be getting an, a bow later on that's even more powerful than all of these, but we'll get that later. Ban hammer, man! That's absurdly helpful. I'm gonna keep that for the final final boss fight for sure. All right, I'm gonna actually move these guys down here. That way we have space for more special items. <laughs> we have so many special items. Ah, or be even special anymore. Yes, they are. Okay. Light. Stacking blocks. Let's go put some stacking blocks away. Wait, are these not the same? Oh yeah, that's very strange. None of they don't stack together. They are stacking blocks. Alright, what can we throw out here? Um we have plenty of ladders. To be honest, we're not gonna use any ladders. <laughs> Why don't we just use oak? Uh, I guess we don't have that much knockback resistance. We have 0.3. That's it. We only have 30% knockback resistance. So it does help. Because when we're stacking with these blocks, we have 100% knockback resistance. But otherwise, we don't. I guess we can put our pickaxe away. Our normal diamond pickaxe for now. It'll free up some space. Right, I'm actually going to do this. So our inventory is going to be a lot neater. And we are going to keep the panic potion right there. That's it. Okay. Additional light right there. So this just really frees up our inventory, you see. bottles. Still have a full chest of them, despite the fact that we used up a ton <laughs> buying everything that we did. Okay. I'm glad we got some more things for our armor, but where is the stuff for the bow? I mean, seriously. Oh boy, this, this chest plate is so good. No, it's not. It doesn't give us the health is the issue. Normally I would use that, but we already have the leggings that serve a similar purpose. So much armor. I'm gonna have to start throwing out some of this old stuff. I just don't have enough space. Makes sense. We're dealing with some really powerful items right now. We really don't need the flint and steel to be in our ender chest right now. We can put that away. And all this can get put away. 
except for the pickaxe. <laughs> that one I like to keep on me, just in case we run into. We have plenty of unbreaking three now, actually. I mean, look at this. We just are not going to run out of unbreaking three anytime soon. Darkness five, though, that's a good book to have. Do we have anything over here? I wonder. Oh, yeah, we do. A few random things we can organize. Carpenter's hammer. Oh, man, that's another good item. That does not belong. Should I put the axe in my sword? Or... Nah, we'll keep it in here for now. 10 attack damage. It's good. Good stuff. Here. We're good. And we're good. We're done with the with the, getting all the stuff we need. Um and our chest is full of armor now. Just so much stuff. Oh, wow, this is actually cool. I didn't notice this. Fire protection, five. Feather falling, five. No, it doesn't have speed on it, sadly. But that's still a pretty good combination, I would say. Oops, those don't belong in there. Okay, where to now? Oh, we need more... We need to put these away. And our models are our ender pearls. We are back in business, baby. Did we miss anything there? No, we, we were going to say we were going to come back, but we ended up finding enough space for everything that we wanted. We have a lot of space now. I'm pretty happy. If we carried the uh, backpack around with us, we would have even more space, but I don't want to risk it. Then again, I know <laughs> I give players backpacks in the next area. I might even give players crafting recipes for backpacks here, so I don't remember. Good, we're in. We're in. Ish. Don't spawn, please. Right, that's one spawner taken down. They're one hit kills right now. Nice. I can't kill them anymore. Oh, I got some stuff. At the foot of the table. Oh, this like spawner up here. Oh, these guys are two hit killers. Two, two hit killers, so. Oh, and they dropped a the bow. Well, they dropped these two killers. Alright, you know what? We need to find the spawner for these guys. Or at least light up this area enough where they won't spawn anymore. You guys can't go in. You guys will be slow in water, but I won't. See, see. Very good. All right, I, want, I just want to go up here and see if there's any spawners around. Right. If I see anything, I don't see anything. It's probably something down there. No, I guarantee you there's something down there. We're not going to go for it right now. Not quite yet. This first. Okay. Ouch, 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 ouch. Okay, we're almost dead, but we can still escape. Straight through, do a number. Okay, well then. I think we just made things worse. Yeah, 
Yeah, this is just to light everyone on fire that's up there. I think we should take it, take it one step at a time, to be honest with you. And block off any area that we haven't entered yet. Up here. So for instance, we've take we've cleared this portion. We're good. Yeah. Really block off. So we are safe from that end of the hall. Here we're gonna have problems, but that's okay. Slowly. Holy lord, that is not okay. There is going to be a lot in here. Backpack head, monkey's head, coat is happy, bread. This bread represents the fulfillment of our action. Why? So it's bread and wine. So it's uh, like the Last Supper. Oh yeah, good name B. Here's two monitors. Someone asked him that on uh, the forums. Hey, good name, do you have three monitors? Oh my, what on earth? What have I got myself into? How much did you get? Oh, I don't need all of this. Just the good ones. Ah, I'm not gonna go for those. Oh wait, I do want those. Oh my ears. They are being massaged by death. It looks like most of these are closed off. I was confused as to why we couldn't get everything. Oh, that kind of really cool item. I just want I don't want anything else to spawn. I want to make sure that Wait, can I not place a torch anywhere? Zemulus for that guy. Right, any other spawners that we can see? Under there, it looks like. Imagine someone said You never know where I hide heads, you know. It's very different people. So this is Thorlon's work. This does not look like Thorlon. Maybe 
Maybe it is, though. No, it's Chill In. Oh, I love Chill In. I love it, all these people. <laughs> Kevin Cool's head's not down here for obvious reasons. Uh, he's already there now. He's, he's already the head for one of the guys. That's a monitor I don't have yet. Oh wait, no, I do. That's monkey's head. Um, do I have the other monitor? Oh, I don't have one quite like this. So let's go ahead and grab it. Are so good now. We got all those heads. Let's drop them off at the head at, at the uh, head place of the monument. I love the transitions for a lot of the whole forest too. So I like going through those. Are there heads in here? No, not really. Uh, anyways, these wines, they give you infinite hunger, but they also give you infinite strength. Now, we already have infinite strength, so we don't need a, We don't need those. This wine represents the blood we spilled for liberty, and this bread represents the fulfillment of our actions. So those are actually pretty iconic items that we should probably keep. Okay, so what do we need to do now? We need to continue along that trek. We haven't gotten any of those chests. We haven't opened any of those chests yet. And again, maybe everything despawned. It seems quiet. Oh, everything did despawn. Oh, well, nothing's spawning down there. So let's go ahead and work on this portion a bit. Where are any spawners? Okay, there's a spawner right there. Oh, there's a spawner right here. That's another thing you could- Oh wait, no, you can't explode TNT, remember? This area is immune to TNT explosions. I think this area was already exploded when we got to it. This is one of those unfortunate situations where, in the process of downloading the world, the person also, there was fire next to this, so the natural consequence of that occurred was explodey. I plan on putting a lot of thought into each the chest in each of these rooms. I didn't put a lot of, you see, the, the one thing that I didn't think a ton about in this map was spawn replacement. Yeah, I, would, I thought about it a lot at the start. That's one of the main things I considered. But towards the end, it was just, well, where can I place this spawner to where nobody will ever be able to find it? And that doesn't necessarily make for a fun map. Um, so that's something I would change if I went back. Um, yeah, those heads we already have. No! Okay. Try not to do that again. Yeah, thank you. You see, I forgot I installed that. I forgot I installed that where it would give you your, uh, your bank slips back if you accidentally placed it. I'm glad because that was awful. Oh boy, that would have cost us. Um, 